Hi, my name is Sharon Brojo, and I'm Senior Clinical Education Specialist for Healthmark Industries. Today we're going to show you how to assemble the Robotic Instrument Protector Card, which is a mounting surface intended to hold and maintain the item with limited movement for packaging and sterilization. Before we get started, here we have a completed Robotic Instrument Protector Card. I'm going to walk you through each step to assemble. The first step is we're going to take the three-dimensional flap and you're going to fold it out and you're going to see two score lines here and you're going to make a crease like so. Then you're going to take these two tabs at the score lines, make a crease on both sides pointing down. Then you're going to insert it in here like so to make that three-dimensional distal end flap, leaving enough room for the distal end of that instrument to go in. The next step is you're going to fold the housing flap back and you're going to take the eyelet at that score line and you're going to make a crease making sure it's up. Then you're going to pop out the retrieval ring folding it down at that crease at the score line. Then we're going to take the housing flap and you're going to see two main creases here. So we're going to crease on that score line here. Do the same for this one and you can see it kind of forms a box. Then we're going to take this last one here in the locking tab and fold that up. Then we're going to take the bottom flap here, the, uh, the last part of the locking tab, fold it down at that score line, make it crease, and now you're ready to insert the instrument. For your final step, you're going to take your robotic instrument and you're going to put the distal end into the eyelet. As you're doing so, you're pushing it through, through the three-dimensional flap at the distal end, taking the housing of the robotic instrument right here into the housing flap. You're going to take this housing flap and you're going to place this tab right behind one of the locking tabs, like so, and take your other locking tab and lock it into the slit. Now you have a completed robotic instrument card. Now that we've assembled the robotic instrument protector card, I want to mention a few features. The first one is the retrieval ring on the proximal end here, as well as the distal end here, which is used for aseptic presentation. I also want to show you this feature on the bottom where you can see two tabs where you place an integrator. As always, if you want more details about the Robotic Instrument Protector Card, you can visit us on our website at hmark.com, as well as contacting your local Healthmark representative.